Gary, another trip to Dartford Under the Lights and we come away with a virtue 1-0. What are your thoughts on the game this evening? Yeah, I thought it was a, certainly a good result, that's for sure. Um, game of, not necessarily game of two halves, I thought first half we were, we were a little bit loose, but we got better. We got better as the game went on and, and, and second half I thought we, we deservedly, like I say, took all three points really. So yeah, really, really pleased. Um, pleased for, 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 for Faz, great run and finish for the goal as well. So and, and pleased for the boys who, who managed to keep a clean sheet as well. So yeah, look, really, really good. Really good um, evening for us, given sort of our, our traffic nightmare on the way down as well. So yeah, really good evening for us. Yeah, I was going to say, not the best of preparations with the, us arriving late due to the traffic and the delay to kick off in the first half as well. Will Henry making some great saves, including that scramble where uh, two or three shots came in in a close succession, but we were able to clear it away. Yeah, absolutely. Look, I think other than that, though, in that first sort of that first half where yeah, one phase of play or one passage of play where. We've had to we've had to block some shots. We've had to block some shots and throw our body, in, you know, in, in the way of a, like I say, some some loose ball in the six yard box. Other than that, I felt we, you know, we had a, a, a fair element of not necessarily control, but um, th th there wasn't an awful lot in the game. Um, but yeah, look, once we we got through that period, and, and then like I said, you know, second half we could have had a, a few more. Fazers Fazers not managed to to get a connection in the six yard box on on one that came across from a good cross from from Eddie Jones, and then Tom May used it the crossbar as well. So. And, you know, with those three and, and a couple of others, we could go on to win the game quite comfortably. But yeah, look, really, really pleased. And a start of a three game run on the road. Do you see the Chippen and travel to Slough on Saturday as well? Uh, what are your thoughts, Heather, the Slough game? Be a really tough game. They're on a really, really good run. They're, they're, they're really, really, you know, really, really good and really energetic. And um, yeah, they've, they've got some good players and, and it'll, be a, it'll be a tough one. Um, hopefully it won't be as, as tough as it was when we went there, there last year. Um, but yeah, look, we'll... We'll, we'll, we'll rest up tonight and, and go and have a look at, at Thursday and, and seeing what we can do against them on Saturday. But yeah, we're looking forward to, to going there. It'll be a really, really tough game. And especially sort of this long run of games coming up as well, sort of the, the, the whole squad rotation, it, very important, especially at this level as well. Yeah, definitely, especially when you've had a long trip, you know, long trip today and then Thursday, hopefully we'll, we'll be able to train a little bit earlier than we, we, we do normally because Thursday becomes, becomes a, a bit of a slog for us sometimes because we, we don't train until late on a Thursday. So given that we've we've had a late one tonight or we won't get back or some of them won't get back until sort of three four in the morning um yeah we'll, we'll have to rest up we've rotated a little bit tonight um and yeah we'll probably look at doing that again on on, on saturday but we'll have to assess it in the next couple of days to to see where the bodies are thank you very much gary thank you